So it's straight over from here. So you go, it goes like a bit of a right and then you go left. Okay. You see. Look out for bridge. Yeah, okay. over cut for bridge. That's good. So right and then over left, yeah. yeah. But if you can get into that right lane again, you'll, you'll benefit more. Brilliant. And now you can just the snake turn, innit? Okay. Because buses are usually on the left, innit? 205 Catford Road. That's the one. Um, the neighbours downstairs, they've been talking racism, they've been saying, oh, dad's a dirty African, they've been saying, oh, yeah, uh, mum's ugly, and then, when, yeah, and then when the police come, they're just saying, oh, yeah, when, um, when dad says they're racist, they're like, oh, yeah, we can't, we can't really say that at the moment. We don't have enough proof. Oh, it's unclear. Mm. So it's just making me feel annoyed because the police don't do nothing. Every time they're coming, they're coming again and again, and they're doing nothing. So mm. like, what's the point of them coming? Yeah, it's so it's socialization at school. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's affecting it's school, that a lot. Yeah, like, school, mm, yeah. 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 So it's, it's really yeah, affecting. We've had numerous co communication with the school. The head of year spoken to us said that she's concerned about his well-being because obviously he's an active learner, but at mm. the moment he's slowing down yeah, in his it's work. Yeah. He's mm. not doing as much. He's drawing away from his friendship groups. Mm. Mate, when I got the email, I broke down. Mm. Because he's, he's a very like, clever boy. He's like good. You no, know, a lot of these kids nowadays they lose faith, don't they? They just. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. and it's easier to be bad than to be good. So exactly. that's why I always praise him, try and whatever mm. they need or he needs, I make sure he has. What we're gonna do, yeah, mm. do the talk to them. Definitely, yeah, go down there and knock and speak to them. Stop this. Yeah, you know what I mean, yeah, brother, because they know why you're here. Yeah, they know. They know, they know why you're here. You come on. I don't have. I don't like seeing. I don't like seeing kids in pain. I don't like seeing kids in stress. I don't so like that. Me up. I want to look over. That I could look up. No, I look over anywhere I want to look. Just, uh, you know what? Yeah, just tell it to Pablo. Okay, tell no, it to no, Pablo. No, look anywhere I want to look. Let, let them tell it to Pablo. You you're, you're, you're getting it confused. Don't get it confused. Man, ain't that in it? So don't get it confused. Yeah, man's chatting to you on a level. Do you understand? What's the problem? Yeah, we moved in what August, mm. and then Rachel came downstairs and was like, "Oh, are you the next tenant?" And we're like, "Yeah, we are." Mm. And she's like, "Oh, let me get the keys up the key safe for you." And I'm like, "All right." She gets the keys up the key safe. And she's calling the, like the council and she's like, oh yeah, let them move in now, let them move in now. So we're like, okay, cool, she's doing us a favour, innit? So she gave us like mattress, bin bags and everything. And we're, I'm thinking, oh, this woman's really nice. And she's like, be careful because she's going to want something from dope. I'm like, cool. So then she calls us up like the next week. She's like, oh, can Sorry. I really come to the garden in the summer? I'm mm -hmm. like, not really because we just moved here and even before that she was well, knocking on the door kids. even before that no, she was knocking on the door saying oh do you want to come out for dessert with us and we're like no we just moved in we don't know you she's calling me family all that she knows all my business where i'm from who my family are she knows everything she made me tell her everything yeah so from when i said no i don't really want you coming in my house mm. because romeo yeah. put a hole in my wall he put muddy footsteps on a fresh carpet on the first day yeah on the first day so we're like um, we don't really want you coming over so then I told her my business about where I lived previously. She's doing that against me now, calling me racist and everything. Where I'm not racist, I've got a mixed race nephew. My ex is black. I'm not racist. Yeah, if I was, I'd show you I'm racist, but I'm not. Anyways, they caused caused all trouble for like nearly a year now since we've been here. How can we resolve this though? That's what we want to do. Yeah, That's what we really want to do. No, but this is what I'm saying. So, so how can it be resolved? We talk to him, yeah, and we're speaking to him now. What do you think we're doing there? When we was running suits down here, they're calling the council, yeah. But he's allowed to smoke up there. 
Who cares? Who cares about bunny zoos? Like. In life, yeah, where there's people you don't like, it. It's gonna be people. We're not gonna get on. Some people ain't gonna get on in it. But we just wanna, we just wanna just resolve it in it. Cause there's true, there's a child in the house, in it. And then they, you're, obviously you've got kids coming there as well, in it. Hold on, I was gonna say that, in it. I was gonna say that. There's kids involved, in it. But you know what? Involved in it. Yeah, that, and that's she's why. She's her kid to cover the camera. She said, "Oh, they're saying racist things about my son." She's using yeah, her. The reason why we're everything. here, we don't like the youths involved in it on either side, in it. Yeah, so we want to come to a resolution. Yeah, if you're not, if you ain't gonna be friends, then you're not gonna be friends in it. Like, let's just I, let's have I, a little bit of respect. All I want, say if I have your girlfriend here and I'm like, yeah, and I'm going around saying, "Oh, he's being racist to my husband, racist to my son, just because I'm not black." She's literally trying to act like. She's not special, do you know what I mean? Like she's trying to say we're doing stuff to them when we're not, just because she ain't getting her attention. That's how I personally feel. Like she's using them for their car. She is. Well, we need to come to some sort of resolution. Do you get what I'm saying? Cause we're not, we don't want no beef or nothing. Come on, I don't want beef. Yeah, we don't want beef. Like, you, like when you go downstairs, be able to come over here and not have any problems. I don't want to be calling the police every yeah, single day. That's you mad. We're not on the, yeah, we're not on the fence. That's, that's that's mad. They're calling the police all the time. On the King's coronation, I was drunk. I was smoking. Let's talk. Can you wait and let me finish? I never slam doors. Your kitchen door is closed. Can you can you let, let me finish? If you yeah, could you please at night stop slamming the kitchen door? It's simple. Yeah, the kitchen door stays open. Your That's kitchen door can. can... It stays open. Well, let's just be let's just be peaceful, yeah. So yeah. everyone respect That's each other. All Do you know we move with the man now? Out here, you get me? Don't know we're out here. Yeah, my brother V. Yeah, we come up to fucking Catford. Yeah, know what time it is? Big A, big A. Yeah. Big T, yeah, that's what we do, man. Community business, man. Yeah, we're really out here doing the community thing. Don't know, don't know. You get me? Yeah, man. This is where it is, my brother. We're building out here. We're really building, really solving them problems. You get me? Really out here as brothers. Yeah, don't know. Don't know. That's what we do. No big nine five, you get me? Hey, we gotta adjust a couple things in that, yeah. And first thing we gotta adjust, yeah. Cause I must have went to that Sasha Johnson day, yeah. And first things first, how come Sasha ain't there? How come you're not there, innit? This is what I'm saying. We don't know the situation respectfully, we don't know the situation that's going on, but we needed to see that pain. If we saw you push out yourself in a wheelchair now and we looked at you, we could have felt that pain, innit? But when we're not seeing you, we can't feel your pain, innit? So when we're seeing GoFundMe and all of this and that, we're thinking, raw, we want to see pain, innit? You should have been out there right now and we should have saw you and that. You don't have to say no words. You could have got someone to say some words for you or something. But that didn't look too right to me, you get me, man? Stepping out and what are we doing? Are we celebrating a woman getting her head licked over? I'm going there, I'm seeing bear singing and clapping and all of this and bear something. I told man already, it's just bear talk I'm seeing. It sickens me, man. Talk and talk and talk and talk. It's cheap. Don't man ever heard that saying, talk is cheap. Nothing ain't going on. But I'm disappointed that we never saw Sasha wheel out herself on that chair and show us and say thanks, like, you understand, for the support that we've been showing. Do you understand that? We want to see her. We want to see that pain. Because if we saw that pain, it would have been a different energy there. The man then would have been talking about how we can really pattern and fix things up. You get me? From when I didn't see no anger or no pain on that level. Like, I'm seeing bare jovial happiness and, you know, like, clapping and, you know, no, nothing's really going on. That disappointed me in the highest form. I'm not going to lie to you. In the highest form. To understand because all this goal fund me and that we would have like man could more part with peas if we see the pain you see us and anyway coming to this goal fund me thing how the fuck you only raise a chain for it when i'm looking at the goal fund me is that all you can raise in two rascal art years is that all the people that are raising for sasha that should have been a 100 200 bags easy easy this goes to show man 
You get me? Goes to show the same people you lean on is the same people that won't even take money out their pocket and support you. You understand that? And that's why I said this whole thing's patterned wrong. You should have came out there, Sash, and showed your thing so we could have felt that pain and it would have made the man then rile up in a different sort of way. Yeah, and start looking at things differently instead of the same old speeches, the same old talking about this and that and not and not go on. You understand? So I stepped in it. I went there to show my respect. But when I saw what it was, I stepped in it because I couldn't really feel that in it. I'm an action man, innit? Like my brother action. I'm an action man. So if there's no action, there's no point in that I'm going on. Do you understand that? I'm not I'm not done that I'm not clapping and celebrating no woman getting her head licked over, because that's what it looked like to me. Music playing celebration. Yeah? Come on man. Yeah, it's not no <laughs> it's ain't no celebration thing. This is a real thing. Not a woman got licked in her head back. It should have never have happened. I understand that should have never have happened. Yeah, but now it, as we have to address it in the right way. That was a disappointing that she never turned up and showed us the pain. We wanted to see that. Yeah, we wanted to see you. We wanted to see that pain. You get me? Cause you're a people's person. You get me? So it don't matter. You have to be out here regardless. Sick. Certain times, you get me? You think I always step? Certain times, man, feel like tired and man, I want to step or man's done a hard work, but man still steps. It don't matter. Cause when you're in this public light and you're talking to people on a certain level, you have to step. Do you understand? So. Disappointing that she never stepped on my brothers that went, yeah, support the thing, you done know already, yeah. Peckham for life, you done know, big UPP.